everyone, gather around. Chibi Maruko-chan is about to... <laughs> hey, Mom, can I please go to the movies tomorrow? The movies? Yeah. We've decided to go so we can have a nice memory of our sixth grade year. That sounds nice. Sure, go ahead. I'm so happy. And I want to wear that dress to the movies. Can I please, Mom? Uh, your favorite dress, right? Mm -hmm. Hey, wait a minute. You don't need to dress up to go to the local movie theater in Shimizu, do you? Your regular clothes will do just fine. After watching the movie, we're going to take a picture to commemorate the day. So Yoshiko-san and I have decided to dress nicely for the picture so we can look nice in it. I see. A commemorative photo. All right. Come here. Great! <sighs> It seems like only yesterday that Sis started grade school, and look at her now, going to the movies. Time flies. She's already in the sixth grade, isn't she? No wonder I feel older now. You sound like an old auntie. Yoshiko-san said that she would even go to a beauty parlor today. A beauty parlor? Yoshiko-san is quite vain, isn't she? Well, there's no chance at all for me to go to a beauty parlor. I guess I'll be fine with my regular hairstyle. Tee tee tee. Hey, come on now, sis. You'll never be a fashionable girl if you think that way. Think much bigger. Huh? Look at this. If you can't go to a beauty parlor, why don't you try and do your hair yourself on this occasion? You're going to wear your favorite clothes, so you should put some effort in. No, I'm fine with this hairstyle. Don't say that. A commemorative picture will last a lifetime, remember? Are you sure you're not going to do anything about your looks for this photo? It'll last a lifetime? Mm. Hey, this looks super cute. Huh? <sighs> That's not possible without going to a beauty parlor. Aye, this looks good, too. Huh? Mm, I told you that's not possible either. Mm. Oh, hey, I think this will look really good on you, sis. Huh? Don't you think you can do this without going to a beauty parlor? Hmm, I guess so, but... Why don't you try it? Come on, let's do it. Huh? Right now? Because you won't know if it looks good on you unless you try. Yeah, I guess that's true, but... With the face of this model, the hairstyle looks cute. But I don't know how it will look with your face. Okay, I'm offended. Whatever. Come on, let's give it a try now. Oh, all right, fine. Guess I should test it out. Sorry I've got such a plain face, Morocco. Let me see here. I do this with one end. And then this? <sighs> mm. I guess I'm done now. Oh, it looks really good. Yeah? Do you think so? Mm. Uh, hmm. Well, you're right. I guess it does work. Once in a while, Maruko can be useful. The next day. Oh, you've totally dressed up. Oh, you look lovely. You look very nice, my dear. Yes, you look like a celebrity that's from TV. Really? Yes, fine feathers make a fine bird. <laughs> You watch your mouth. <laughs> that movie was so much fun. All right, everyone, come on, let's take a picture. Yeah. Here, line up right there. <laughs> That's it, we're closer now. A few days later. <laughs> huh? Hi there, sis. Yeah, hey. Huh? Sweet potatoes are steamed. Come here. Ah, uh, yay, sweet potatoes, sweet potatoes. Let's go eat them, sis. I don't want any. Uh-huh. I'm not hungry. Well, I have to do my homework. Uh. Didn't your sister want any? No. Nope. I wonder if something is wrong with her. I know, it's quite strange. She loves sweet potatoes. Hmm. Huh? That could be it. Is she on a diet? On, on a, a diet? diet? You see, Sis is at a sensitive age. She might be worried about her weight or something funny like that. There's no way. That's ridiculous. Akiko isn't fat at all. Yes, it's ironic, isn't it? Sis, who doesn't need to be on a diet, is on one. And Mom, who needs to be on a diet, keeps eating like there's no tomorrow. Oh. That comment hits too close to home. It's fine. I feel healthy and happy the way I am right now. That's right, Maruko. The way your mother looks suits her just fine. If she became slimmer, she wouldn't be recognizable as your mother. Uh, I don't know about that, Grandpa. Now listen, Maruko. A slim mother is not your mother, understand? Your mother must always be round and roly-poly. <laughs> uh, Sakiko, dear? <gasps> 
You don't want any potatoes? Uh, what was that? What'd you say, Mom? Being on a diet isn't good for you. You're still growing. Huh? I'm on a diet? Around your age, the best thing to do is eat well and build up your body. It doesn't matter if you get a little bit more round. I'm not on a diet. Where'd you get that idea from? Eh? Huh? Oh, you're not on one? Hey, you made up something again, didn't you? <laughs> I'm sorry, Mom, but I just don't feel hungry today. That's all it is. Oh, come to think of it, you did say that earlier. Oh, is that all it is? I worried about your sister needlessly thanks to you, Maruko. <laughs> well, come on then, you can help me skin carrots now. What? Right now? Sis is doing her homework now, but you're free, aren't you? No, I'm not free. I was thinking about watching TV and eating some snacks and just relaxing. That's what we call being free. Oh, it's all right, Mom. I've just finished my homework, so I'll go and do it. Oh, are you sure? Thank you, dear. Sure. <laughs> Lucky me. Uh-huh. I wonder what this is. Oh, hey, isn't this... Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, hey! How dare you look through my things? How could you? Oh, wow, sis. That's... that's so... Uh... <laughs> <laughs> oh, stop it! Stop it! Stop it! You're so mean! How dare you do that? Why did you have to look at it, Maruko? How dare you... Oh, come on! What's going on, you two? What is the matter? What happened here? This is being mean to me. <laughs> but then why is she the one crying if you were the one being bullied by her? The picture. <laughs> I see what this is about. What a cruel gust of wind, and right at that moment... It's the risk you take when you take a picture outside. And this is going to be our commemorative picture that lasts a lifetime. Lifetime? Come on, you're exaggerating. Didn't you say that? Don't worry about it, dear. No one will laugh at you over this thing. Maruko burst into laughter when she saw it. I bet everyone else at school is laughing about it, too. <laughs> To begin with, it was all Maruko's fault for picking that awful hairstyle. How could you, Maruko? You're so mean. Uh, it's the wind you should blame. Because of this picture, I bet I'm going to be called Sakura the Mustache for the rest of my life. Sakura the Mustache. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you laughed. You laughed again. I can't help it. Sorry. You'll never know how I feel right now, how embarrassed and awful it is. <laughs> <laughs> Maruko? Here, look, look! Oh. Hey, what are you doing, Maruko? I'm going to take a picture with this face for my next photo. Don't be silly. What do you mean for your next photo? Next photo means next photo. All right, I'll do it too. Huh? No, honey. No, Grandpa, stop it. Yes, I'm going to take a commemorative picture of the Senior Citizens Club like this. Uh. <laughs> Grandpa, please don't do that. Wow, Grandpa, you look so much younger now. Do you think so? <laughs> <laughs> Maruko, the moustache looks good on you. I know, I know. <laughs> the both of you. You're so silly. Uh. I've had enough. Mom, can I have the sweet potato now, please? I feel hungry for some reason. Sure, sure. <laughs> uh. <laughs> the next day. Really? The picture will be retaken? Uh-huh. See? If you take a good look, you can see that some people have their eyes closed. So we decided to take it again. I'm happy for you. So are you going to dress up again, sis? No. I'm going to go in my regular clothes. I've had enough of Sakura the mustache, you know. Sis, I know you look very lovely when you dressed up for the picture, but I think you're pretty enough just the way you are right now. Yes. <laughs> Thank you, guys. Being normal and natural can be a good thing. You know, you seem to have matured a bit. <laughs> <laughs> Who are you to say that? Be normal and natural. Those words have deep meaning. Oh. Mm.
Well, that wasn't normal. And it was definitely unnatural. Uh, excuse me, sir. Will you take a picture for us? <laughs> right on. Thank you. Uh, say cheese. <laughs> Sis cried a lot about it. Yet she couldn't help laughing when it happened to someone else. That's the way life goes. In this episode, Tomachan, are you angry at me? It was funny, wasn't it? That drifter show yesterday? Hmm, Nakamoto Koji was so good at doing gymnastics. Here. <laughs> <laughs> Maru-chan, are you all right? Uh, I'm okay, I'm okay. <laughs> uh, uh? Oh, no! During the last week, my mom has been teaching me how to make kusudama. Oh, no, it's been smashed. Oh. I'm sorry, Tama-chan. Oh, it's all right. Don't worry about it, Maru-chan. Uh... Kusudama? Hmm. See, Tama-chan said she was making it. I've made kusudama before. It takes a lot of work, too. Really? How do you make it, Grandma? Hmm. First, you fold like this. Hmm. Let me try it as well. Fold this part this way. Hmm. You mean, like this? Hmm. <laughs> I did it! <laughs> so clumsy. <laughs> you need to make lots of these and then you shape them into a ball. After that, it's suspended by a string and then it's done. I see. It's quite hard to make one. I feel pretty terrible about what I did to Tama-chan earlier. What did you do, dear? I smashed the half-done kusodama that Tama-chan's mother was teaching her to make. Oh. But Tama-chan didn't get angry. She forgave me and told me not to worry about it. So why did you smash it, Maruko? Well... I was mimicking the drifter's gymnastics, just like this. And then I stood up and posed, and then... Hey, is that drifters? Nice, let me try. Here. Come on, Grandpa. It took me a lot of time to make that. I'm sorry, Maruko. Will you forgive me? No. Maruko, your grandpa didn't smash it intentionally. You know that. You shouldn't get mad at him. You know, do you think Tama-chan is actually angry at you? I mean, you got angry with grandpa, and only one clumsily done piece was smashed. I'm sure hers were nicer. Mm -hmm. Good point. It must be because Tama-chan is sweet, so she didn't even yell at you. Come to think of it at that time, Tama-chan looked very disappointed by what I did. So, you see? Huh? Oh, my goodness, you're absolutely hopeless, aren't you? Grandma, please don't give up on me, please! Oh, boy, Grandpa. <laughs> Maybe Tama-chan feels the same. I can't believe it! I'm so fed up with you, Maru-chan! Uh, hello? May I please speak to Tama-chan? Oh, Maru-chan. I'm sorry but she just stepped out. Eh? She went out at this hour of the day. Maybe she's too angry to answer my phone call. <sighs> the next day. I'm super late again. I've got to hurry outside. All right. Everyone get into pairs and start doing your stretching exercises. <laughs> hey, hurry! I'm sorry. Tama chan. Oh, Mario chan. Let's do it, Honami san. I yeah. Hmm? I I'm sorry, Mario chan. Sakura, so you don't have a partner? How about we do our stretching together? Uh, oh, yeah. One, One two, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Tama-chan, 
She is angry at me. That's why she didn't want to pair up with me. Hey, Sakura, concentrate. And three, and four, and five, and six. Stretch! What should I do? What's wrong, Maru-chan? Uh, well, uh, I was wondering if you want to play with me today. I'm sorry. I'm going out with Mom to do some shopping today. I see. Then how about tomorrow? It's Sunday. I wish I could, but I have a piano lesson tomorrow, and I have to go. Uh, but you usually don't have piano lessons on Sunday. I'm sorry. Well, let's play some other time, yeah? It must be because Tama-chan is sweet, so she didn't even yell at you. Some other time, she's lying. Tama-chan is actually angry at me, but she's just too sweet to say so. I suppose that Kusadama meant a lot to her and took time to make. <sighs> How can I make her forgive me? Maruko? Huh? Oh, hi there, Grandpa. I'm very sorry about yesterday. Here, this is my apology to you. Wow, origami paper! <laughs> oh, so many! All right! <laughs> now, do you have some lily yarn, Maruko? Huh? Give me a minute. Hey, sis! Uh, I guess she isn't here. Lily yarn, some lily yarn. Oh, I got it! <laughs> On Sunday. Uh, good morning. Yeah, late morning, I would say. Uh, uh, maybe I overslept a little bit. I should finish breakfast quickly and make my kusadama. You're finally up. Hey, Maruko, your sis was grumpy when she got up this morning. Do you have any idea why? I don't know. But where is sis? Yoshiko-san's house. Huh? Oh, wait. Maybe she's angry because I took her lily yarn yesterday without her permission. I guess I better remember to apologize to her later. Here, look, it's all done. All right! I'm sorry, Tama-chan. Tama-chan, I'm sorry. Huh? Oh, Tama-chan. What's the matter? Uh, I, uh, well, I just... Fuyami san Huh? <laughs> uh, oh, Fuyuta-san. Oh, Sakura-san, good afternoon. Why is Fuyuta-san coming to Tama-chan's house? I get it. She made plans to play with Fuyuta-san today, so she couldn't play with me. I knew it. Her excuse of having a piano lesson was a lie. Thank you for gym class yesterday. I was happy that Onami-san did stretch exercises with me really happy. So thank you so much. No, you really don't need to thank me for that. Onami-san, uh, I want to give you this. This is one of my favorites. Uh, See you. <laughs> Mara-chan, I'm so sorry. Huh? About gym class yesterday. Fuyata-san asked me to partner with her before Maru-chan showed up. Huh? So that was it. Huh? Oh, yeah. Just got back from my piano lesson. The lesson had to be booked on Sunday this week because of my teacher's schedule. Oh. Uh, so I, uh... Here! Huh? About that the other day. I was making it to give it to you, Maru-chan. Do you like it? Huh? It was for me? On the day you called, my mom asked me to run an errand so I dropped by the stationery store to buy origami paper so I could remake it. Oh, that's why she wasn't home when I called her. <laughs> Tama-chan, are you not mad at me? Huh? I mean, weren't you angry at me at all because I smashed your kushadama? No, I wasn't mad at you at all. Really? Mm-hmm. <sighs> I am so relieved. Thank you for this. <laughs> <sighs> and here. <gasps> yeah, I made this for you with my grandma's help. Here. Thank you so much. I'm sorry I smashed yours the other day, Tama-chan. Mm-mm. Beautiful. Uh, it's really beautiful. Uh, oh, right. I wonder what this is. Huh? Uh. How shall we judge for you to son's taste? Goodness.
I'm relieved. Tomachan wasn't mad at me after all. <laughs> oh, yeah, maybe the thought I had about Sis being angry at me for taking her lily yarn is just a needless worry, and I'm overthinking it. <laughs> Maru -ko! Come here! You used my lily yarn without my permission. Just admit you did it now! I was going to make a kusadaba with Yoshiko-san, and I couldn't do it! Ah, she is not a man! Unlike Tama-chan, Sis isn't as sweet as Maro-chan thought she'd be.